Hey everyone, welcome to Kip TV. I am Kip and you see Nine Engineer, so that means it's the next installment of the Texas Gunslinger Massacre on uh, here on Steel. Let's meet the teams because there's really nothing going on in setup except about nine million uh, dispensers and teleporters. So for the NG team on blue, we have Beware the Ice Cubes, Five Eyes, Half Nutmeg, Nova, Venomous Pastry, and Innocent Spy Crab, Kobe Con, the Texas Something, Toby, Massacre Junior, B-Day, and Game Master. Over on the Highlander team, we have the Alpha TF2 is Scout, Jigsaw is Demo Man, Pony is Sniper, Selby is Demo Man, Selby's gonna be playing regular Demo Man, and Jigsaw is gonna be on Demo Knight. Hammock is... N Heavy Red Axe and Ranger is Pyro, Simon is Soldier, CD Man 2021 is Spy, and Cubicus Boxfish is Medic. So let's get on an interesting cam. Not that Nine Engineers building teleporters is an interesting, but uh, Selby went pretty big in the first two maps. Um, if you haven't seen them, close your ears right now because I'm going to tell you what happened in them. Uh, Engineers won both those rounds, uh, Badlands and Badwater, both going to the NGs right there, so pretty impressive stuff. Oh man, Jigs are coming in from behind, taking down Kobecon, the Texas man, to save his medics. Here comes the Uber Pop off of Selby, we'll see. He already took down a few little sentry guns up there on the hill, but they just keep on hopping. Uh, one way to control the NGs is definitely to control the ammo, and depending where you are on in this map of steel, uh, it's, it's uh, difficult to get ammo. But uh, this first map, this first uh, place point is the word I'm going for. Isn't too difficult. You have a hundred pack ammo right here, and then some over there as well. There you go. <laughs> and then she's already making their move on the point right here. But there is a heavy medic combination, and uh, that is so OP when all you have is engineers to throw at it. They're going to try to peck away with this mini century. But two engineers just going back and forth trying to take picks at them. But I uh, really got to get the medic right now and keep it box. What is it? Cubicus box fish. That's right. Uh, has close to 90% right here. We do have an NG charging and taking it down Cubicus right there well, with uh, quite a bit of charge. Um, but Hammock stays up with about half health. He is just going to hang out and see if he can't survive any more NGs that throw themselves at him. Looks like he will be joined by Jigsaw, his, his friendly neighborhood uh, dead demo knight. Um, but there we go. Finally... Hammock is taken down, but uh, that he held onto the point long enough to give time for his team to get respawns. And uh, now we're going to see Cubicus Boxfist got oh, Blue Sager in there. Very nice. Selby, oh, the Pompson is out. That's right, there are no rules in this Texas Gunslinger Massacre. Pompson, uh, Widowmaker, you bring it, uh, and then you die to it. <laughs> or the other team will die to it. Anyway, uh, looks like engineers will be able to cap this finally, um, and yeah, okay, two minutes is not a finally type situation, but uh, it, it just seems like it's longer when it's just engineers doing things, because anyway. Anyway, we're going to watch Jigsaw as he tries to get in here to defend. Oh god, there's a lot of sentries is what he just said uh, in comms right there. And now he's going to try to go for the NG on the point. It gets the kill. Massacre Junior B-Day more than three days, I guess is his entire name. But uh, my birthday is in more than three days, too. You don't see me telling everyone. Uh, but anyway, he goes down as he did get some time on the point there. Um, and uh, starting the cap uh, for the rest of his team. But uh, this is going to be a little delayed as Red is now getting some good positioning on here. Usually you have their sentry gun and stuff put up here, but uh, obviously that's not going to be the case when you don't have an engineer. Now let's uh, talk about where all these NGs are, because they're obviously not pushing B. So we do have some in here on E. Uh, remember, E, you don't get the lovely little platforms until you cap C. So that uh, is going to make it significantly more difficult for the engineers. They won't be able to pressure E like uh, usually Highlander teams are able to. They'll put their scouts, their demo man, soldier on E and get some those jumping classes to, to put pressure on uh, but uh, with engineers, with only mini sentries, it's going to be a lot harder. You can sentry jump with mini sentries, but only straight up. And I don't think you're going to be able to get the angle right for this. Um, Innocent Spy Crab doing some interesting stuff right here. I think he's out of ammo because he's just using his pistol right now. So uh, I don't think that's going to get very far. So uh, I haven't seen anybody attempt to uh, make that jump. And uh, cause I, I, I'm not sure. I, I really don't know, and uh, I would like go and practice and uh, see if it's possible, but I can't. I'm a terrible sentry jumper, so me not being able to do it doesn't mean it would not be able to be done. 
if that made sense at all. Anyway, uh, <laughs> she's having a hard time getting coordinated right here, and I think they just need to abandon E, push from, uh, from spawn, and uh, do standard pushes right here. Just go full out, uh, guns a blazing. Literally, well, not blazing, I guess, but uh, just keep those mini sentries doing damage. Uh, pick off the med. That's where you need to uh, really attack this team hard. The Highlander team's best asset they have right now is going to be that uh, that medic. Meanwhile, I saw some these <laughs> engines are going crazy with the the melee fist, um, which is. Funny to watch, but has got to be very, very frustrating. So finally we have this uber pop from Red. They're going to use it to push back these NGs who are just everywhere like ants. And those mini sentries are like ant hills. And they just keep coming. And there's... Oh, so much. <laughs> so they take down the uh, sentry guns in the yard. But they have to get the ones up here. And engineers chasing down. Cubicus box fist goes down to that uh, one of those mini sentries. Of course. Uh, we'll see what so we'll get on the beware the ice cubes can. Is he going? Is he going to put down a mini sentry? I th I think he is, ladies and gentlemen. Um, looks like. Oh, hey, never mind. There's an ng. I mean, a heavy and a scout just crouching in the corner. Um, heavy, of course, hiding from those mini sentries. But he does go down as he gets charged. So hammock getting taken down to massacre, and of course the scout. Where is he? He's gone. These mini centuries are like oh, his worst nightmare. It's got to be the worst day of his life. Uh, but oh, some huge stickies coming in from Selby. Uh, actually, only carry, killing two right there, and you got to get them all. Otherwise, the NGs just keep coming back. Um, oh, well, I found their dispenser forest. <laughs> Except, uh, looks like CD Man 2010 got there as well, and Alpha 2120. 2021 uh, is going to help take out that stuff too, and he just can't quite catch up with him, and he's got that back going, but no, finally Kobe Khan gets the punch in, and out he goes. So it looks like uh, the NGs are splitting forces, and that's uh, probably the problem at this point. I think they're best in big numbers. Oh, but man, these NGs, that, that fist. Um, so yeah, I think they're probably best in large numbers with the most amount of uh, teleporter, I mean, just... Uh, what's the word? Mini sentries! There we go. Mini sentries going at once. Uh, there's really no point in um, having presence at E, I think. Um, I don't know, but we'll see. We'll see how this goes there. It looks like they're converging on point C right now, but I uh, really don't have uh, the player presence to do this. Uh, yeah, down goes a Massacre, but oh, here's a nice flank from Nova, but uh, Nova actually does get the kill or uh, assist right there on Simon. Down goes Selby and Pony as well, so this actually will be a cap from the Engineers. I don't mean to sound like surprised, but... I thought uh, the Highlander team had better positioning than uh, the NGs, but I think they, they lost their med, and that uh, obviously is going to be significant. Now Alpha, the Alpha TF2, going to see if he can uh, take on all these NGs by himself. Um, but he's joined by his Demo Knight, and yeah, Jigsaw getting innocent spy grab. Um, so these demos, having a lot of fun. Selby is in first with 41 points. What? He's just having way too much fun with these mini sentries, getting all sorts of points. That is ridiculous. Um, but yeah, as you can see, the bridges are now coming out, so uh, we'll see if the engines take a more aggressive approach here and uh, just try to put everybody on E. E caps extremely slowly, over a minute um, with the most amount of people. You can't... Um, so yeah, it's really frustratingly <laughs> slow. So look at it go. <laughs> Look at it go. Kobe kind of with some of those crits trying to barge in there and does take down a hammock. So hammock thought he had enough health, but no denied. And Inji's uh, getting super close right here. Is anybody on red going to stop them? No. And that's the time of eight minutes and five seconds. Again, it, it felt a little longer than that, but uh, whatever. That is the NG score. Or it's time. Whatever. So that brings us to the second half of the first round, I believe. We're just going to play best of this so oh, just one round that's what I'm trying to say just one round of this um, because they we did play I think all these maps in one day so uh, quite a bunch of stuff going on so after this there will be oh what is it double cross I believe so um, that should be fun okay so you just saw that NG who is that that was uh, who's putting a center gun here why can't I see whose it is Ah, whatever. Um, so that sort of jump is possible. I guess he just didn't want to risk it with uh, with point E. Maybe I did just not. 
Maybe I just didn't catch all of the failed sentry jumps. Um, uh, but well, engineers were trying to do that or any some, or something. I don't know. But uh, regardless, we didn't see any anything like that. All right, we're gonna get on the Selby cam because he's been going crazy. Uh, we'll see what he does right here. Takes the Uber immediately outside of the gate, trying to get as many sentry guns down. But I think the key right here is to get engineers down. The spawns are so long for red on defense or on this map, um, but caught out right there, and down goes, uh, down goes Selby. Medic somehow stay alive, that's Cubicus, um, Boxfish, and it looks like he's back in spawn right there. Meanwhile, all NG's up and accounted for, uh, so a, a strong first hold right there, I guess. At this point, if I were the Highlander team, I'd say screw A, let's just go B, and put up stickies, and try to do that as much as possible. It'd be difficult, because you won't have a Teleporter or anything like that. Uh, watching Pony just try to snipe as many mini centuries as he can, uh, which is not a bad idea. In fact, it's a very good idea. Have the sniper on mini sentry duty as well. Just everybody should be on mini sentry duty. Um, oh yeah, just look at that. <laughs> uh, so so far, Angie's still holding on to this the first point. Um, Blue is about 60% Uber, so probably waiting for that to push out. Uh, they're going to take a little bit more time as they're just staying in a uh, spawn. Let's try to find somebody doing something here. Uh, CD Man has uh, got the diamond back out, and uh, let's see what he goes for. Again, I say get the NG kills and then uh, worry about the mini sentries because the mini sentries just so easily go down and then uh, can. Uh, Oh, the, the Angie's rebuilt them so fast, but he did actually get two sentries in there, so not a bad streak, but again, these Angie's are up, so the, those two are going back up immediately. Uh, we do have this 100% Uber ready to go um, from Cubicus Boxfish. I don't see anybody attached to him right now. Um, maybe it will be Selby again. We will see. Actually, the Uber is popped on the Pyro. That's not a bad idea right there, getting up close and personal with those many sentries with those engineers and uh, now the NGs are falling and looking a lot better this push but oh down goes Cupid's Boxfish who's too obsessed with uh, sawing down that dispenser he did not realize he was being uh, shot by that mini century but a good push right here for blue they just need to continue on Jigsaw coming and getting the 2k right there one with the shield one with the sword a nice <laughs> nice demo night uh, action right there um, but we'll see again blue is so close right here to just wiping out this defense they need to Get in here and one more push, I think, would do it. Uh, they don't have the players right now. But, oh, here comes Selby uh, taking down two sentry guns right there with the medic on his tracks. Oh, but down goes the mad, down goes Selby, and that is no good for this push by Blue. They do have the soldier out here, uh, but that is Simon, and he is downed. Dead to a mini sentry. Cause of death, mini sentry. Pony going huge. Taking out the sap sentry gun. <laughs> just probably to piss off CD man. <laughs> I always enjoy that, taking out uh, things that are already sapped just to get the, the kill instead of the spy. That's what you get for not playing a real class. Oh, I kid, spy is really hard and that's why I don't play it. Anyway, we are <clears throat> getting uh, it's time is going fast. Now, we don't have the capture time set because they had to re-execute the configs because something was wrong but the time for the NG's cap time was 8.05 so remember that is the time we are going for or the time Highlander team is looking to beat but they're just having a really hard time on this uh, first point and not looking great so I'm a little nervous and worried for them because remember they've lost the other two so uh Little, um, a little much hanging out here for them. Uh, speaking of hanging out, hammock. Um, I guess he's just playing. I don't even know what he's doing. <laughs> you can't even call it spawn camping. But it looks like Blue has finally decided. Like, okay, screw point A. Let's go eat. Let's just get this done with. Pull the bandaid off all at once. Um, they already got the scout on the point. Selby will join him. Uh, there is an Uber ready. Okay, so it looks like Hamick was just getting into position uh, to have the rest of his team join him. And now they're just going to do some good old-fashioned spawn camping. And Pony going big and getting several headshots in a row. Uh, let's see how fast I can get on his camera. Uh, yeah, he's just... 
point it and click at the spawn and with five on the point uh looks like the highlander team will be able to do this pony is just going crazy with uh cleaning up on these kills we'll see if anybody else comes out of the spawn door in time but finally the highlander team gets it right there you go four minutes to 50 seconds <laughs> all it took was one push for e and they got it so there you go that means it is now two to one we'll see if the highlander can team can come back and double cross so definitely make sure you check out that big guys and uh, we're just gonna keep watching as oh i wanted jigsaw to get more <laughs> but uh yeah that is the end of the round it looks like they're going to it it i know it looks like they're gonna play another one but in my intel it says they didn't all right so thanks so much for watching guys have a good day